So angle one plus angle two is equals to uh, 180 degrees. So five is to four. So five X plus four X is equals to 180 degrees. Nine X, 180 degrees. X, 20 degrees. This means that Angle one is equals to five X is equals to a hundred degrees. And one is equals to angle three is equals to angle five and is equals to angle seven. All of them are equal. One is equals to three is equals to five is equals to seven. Angle two is equals to a four X. That would become our 80 degrees. And angle two is equals to four is equals to six is equals to eight. So angle two is equals to angle four, vertically opposite. Four is equals to six, alternate interior. Six is equals to eight, vertically opposite. So this is the answer you'll have got. Now see, it's so easy. A plus D is equals to 180 degrees. Co interior angles. Yes, true, false. Remember, we had done yesterday, okay, if they are yeah. that, okay, now. Yeah, yeah. This yeah. one and this one, they are co interior angles. They will be what? Supplementary. A, plus D is also equals to 180 degrees. Again, the same thing, co-interior angles. This angle and this angle. This line is parallel to this line. This is the transversal, okay? So this means that, this means that, a plus B is equals to A plus D. What cancels? A, A cancels. A cancels and then D, B. See, this is what you had to prove. Yes. Okay. So it, 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 it is actually practically pretty easy. In each of the questions, in each of the questions, you will have to draw a line parallel to A, B, and C, D. In each of the questions, you need to draw a line parallel like this. Okay? <clears throat> now, see. This is a 65. If this angle is a 65, then we have not used which color, which color, which color. Uh, 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 we have used green, blue. Mm -hmm. Okay, yeah. So this will also be 65 alternate interior. If this is 35, this will also be 35 alternate interior. So X is equals to how much? 65 plus 35. That is equals to a hundred. Okay. Now look at this. Huh? Two ninety. Okay. Yeah. We'll check that out. Okay. Two eighty. Two eighty. Two eighty. Two eighty. Two eighty. Okay. Let's check. Okay. Now. 55 plus, let's say this is an A, this is a B. 55 plus A is a 180. A is equals to 125. 25 plus B is equals to 180. Co-interior angles, huh? So B is equals to 155. So X is equals to an A plus B that is equal to one, two, five plus one, five, five. That is equals to how much? Two, eight, zero. Okay. Now out here, let's again, this be an A, this be a B. 
So you can use the same fundamental. 116 plus A plus B is equals to 180. So B is equals to how much? 120, 64. Okay. And uh, 124 plus A is equals to 180, co-interior angles. So A is equals to 180 minus 124, 60, 56. So A plus B, yes, perfect. A plus B is uh, our X. That is the 64 plus 56. That is 120 degrees. Bilkul say. Okay. Now, now let's look at some wonderful questions. Okay. So we have we have a Z forming like this. This is our Z. Naira said something. No. Okay. And then there is another line coming like this. Okay. So it is given to us that A, B, C, D, E, and F are parallel to each other. All of them are parallel to each other. The angle here, the angle here is our 70 degrees. The angle here is 130 degrees. We have to find this angle that is an X degree. So let's say, let's check, okay? Can it? Mm -hmm. Okay. The first thing is let's mark this as a Y. So we have the X plus Y as a 70 degrees by alternate angle okay and then a y plus 130 is equals to 180 by the co-interior angles so y is equals to a 50 degrees so my x plus y was a 70 oh perfect so x is equals to 20 degrees shabash now now we are going ahead to the next question. In this question, you may need to do a construction. This is a line out here. This is a line out here. They are going like this and joining here. So this is our A, B, C, D. E, this is 20 degrees, this is 20 degrees, and this is an X degree, and this is the 130 degrees. So go ahead, all yours. Okay, let's look at it, okay? Now, the construction goes from here, okay? So let this angle be, let's say, y. Now, there is a property of exterior angle of a triangle. Exterior angle of a triangle, okay, this is 130 out here, says that it is equal to the sum of the interior opposite angle. Okay? Or you could do one more thing. You could say, Ki bhai, I know my linear pay. So this is my 50. This is perfectly fine. Straight line would be 50. Now, this is a 50. This is a 20. So, it becomes 170. Sorry, 170. 70. So, if that is a 70, this will be how much? Now, look at this. Corresponding angles. Corresponding angles are equal. So, this is what? Yeah. 110. Yeah. Got it? Mm -hmm. Wonderful question. Yeah. It uh, was a pain. Oh. And now, now let's have a better one. This is out here. And it goes here. Oh, wait, this line is not straight. Oh, all the lines are there. Okay. 
So we have it here and then this line goes like this and we have a line parallel coming from here. Okay. So this is A, B, C, D, E. And A, A B is A B is parallel to C D. We have to prove that angle B is a minus angle B C E is equal to angle A E C. Ye prove can I? Chalo, go ahead. Um, so I basically just said that since all these angles A, E, and C angles are same, then the uh, supplementary couple would, yeah, right? Enough? No. Because you made the same sign all over the place. Oh, that is, I made it to market for you. <laughs> I So that, you know, you can see, oh. okay, it, they're not so equal, they're not equal, they're same. not equal. Okay, now, oh. now, the first yeah. thing. The first thing that we need to do is we need to extend this line. Okay. Now let's say we extended it to F. This angle is equals to this angle. Why? Alternate. No, corresponding, not alternate. Exactly right. They are corresponding angles. So both of them are equal. ठीक है अब a and this one let's say this is whatever we take b a plus b is equals to 180 yeah. and b plus c plus e is also equals to 180 mm -hmm. this would mean that a plus b is equals to b plus c plus e so B and B goes away. Okay. A equals C and E. A is equals to C plus E. And you want one. A minus C. So bring the C this side. A minus C is equals to E. Okay. Fritz a dekna what I did. Fritz a dekna. Now, now, now I'll use only the diagram to do it. We have, we have a line parallel like this. Okay. This goes out here and joins this line. So we have to prove that, okay, but where is the diagram once I need to look at it? This is A, this is B, this is a C, this is a D, and this is an E. So it's given to us, it is given to us that AB is parallel to CD. And we have to prove that BAE, let's say A, okay. Minus DCE, let's say a B, and is equals to AEC, let's say a C. So basically, we have to prove that A minus DCE was a B is equals to a C. This is what we have to prove. Okay. So what did we do? What was the construction? The construction was pulling BA to a point F. Now. This whole line, BF is parallel to CD. So by corresponding angles, this will also become B. Take care. Now, instead of using that 180, I could have used one more property of a triangle. In a triangle, the exterior angle is equal to the sum of the interior opposite angle. So A is equal to B plus C. Exterior angle is equals to the sum of the interior angles. Now, what do I have to do? I just need to pull the B this side. You could have done it in one more way. Okay, what way is that? You could have said, Ki, I don't want to do this as the construction. I'll do this as the construction. Okay, now if this was the construction, this, this, look at this A. This is A with this transversal out here. This would become what? A. Corresponding angles. Now in this big triangle, in this big triangle, again, 
a is equals to b plus c because the exterior angle of a triangle is always equals to the sum of interior opposite angle. Bounces. I hope not totally bounces. It will come. Now, this is here, okay, like this, and this is here, like this, and this is here, like this, and then it goes like this. So basically, it is given to us that this line is parallel to this one, and this line is parallel to this one. This is my A, B, C, D, and an E. This is my x degrees. This is my 75 degrees. Okay. So I need to find x. So what happened out here? Uh -huh. Batao, batao. Yeah, go ahead. Okay. Um, 75 uh, supplementary angle was 105. And then, no, actually, basically, what I did was carry the 75 over huh. uh, the corresponding angles. Huh. And then, um, I'd say you did I, it like this you did the construction. Yeah, I first brought up and then I flipped the light on the left. Huh. And then I found it. Five. Now, yeah. you could, you, I don't know if it makes sense or not. No, no, it makes sense. Perfectly makes sense. See, you could have done it this way also. 75 plus 105, 180 because of co-interior angles. Take it. And X is equals to 105 because of alternate angles. Yes. Take it. Okay. 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 I'm giving you all one more question. Oh, I am having a nice time today. <laughs> So we have uh, two lines parallel, and there is a line given out here. Okay, this is the thing. So this is A, a B, a C, a D, and an F. They have marked the angles as something else. So we have a P out here. We have a Q out here. Q, Q, and an R. And we have to prove that, to prove P plus Q minus R is equal to 180 degrees. Go ahead. Here we have, okay, we have, this would be R, okay, I'm using a different color. This would be R because of alternate angle. Yeah, and then okay. R is half of Q. Right? Now, now let this be. Let this be. No, no. R is not half of Q. But it is not a bisector. Let this be A. P and A is equals to one eighty degrees. Right? These are two lines parallel. Co interior angles P and A. Okay. So P and A would be one eighty degrees. But A is equals to Q minus R. Yes or no? Look at this A. Is A is equals to Q minus the R? Take it. So A ke badle me kya dal do? Q minus R is equals to 180 degrees. Once more. Take it. Doing it once more, I'll make a bigger diagram. So we have this line parallel to this line, okay? Okay, and this is, where is my that? Here and here, okay? We have this P out here, we have this whole of Q out here, and this is R, okay? Now, construction. 
construction, we drew a line parallel from here. Okay, these are parallel. I said that this is A and this is B. Is B equals to R? Look at this. Is it forming a Z? So Z means alternate angle. Okay. P plus A. P plus A is equals to 180 degrees. Okay. Like this. If the co-interior angles are there, then in parallel lines, they are supplementary. Okay. Now, what is my A in terms of Q? This is my R now. Our whole angle Q is equals to an A plus an R. So A is equals to Q minus R. Now substitute. Khatam kaani. P is equals to P plus Q minus R equals to 180. And this is what we had to prove. Take it. So we'll do more of such questions in the next class. So happy nightmares with parallel lines tonight. <laughs> Chalo, bye. A nice bye. bye. Naira, this Alu wants to talk to you. How did you pronounce my name right? Huh? How did you pronounce it? Is, is my name short? It's a short cipher. How do you know my name? I.